So as an adult, still the most common cause of developing a lump in your neck is an inflammatory cause. So something like having a sore throat, tonsillitis, or some kind of infection that causes a lymph node in the side of the neck to swell up. Now, the, uh, the treatment is often antibiotics, and you would expect after a couple of weeks that an, an infected or inflammatory lymph node would disappear or go down uh, significantly with treatment. Now, if it doesn't go down after a period of time, that's a, that's a problem, and we'd be more concerned about it. So if you develop a lump in the neck and it's persistent, that needs to be looked into. There are other causes for lumps in the neck, and that's why we're worried, the main one being we're worried about someone having a cancer, particularly as an adult. So if it's a persistent lump, it doesn't go down, uh, we'd be concerned about that or it needs to be ruled out. Now, if someone has other symptoms, like they have a sore throat or they have a hoarse voice, difficulty swallowing, earache that can't be explained, and they also have a lump in the neck, that's very worrying to us and we'd be concerned that that patient could have a cancer. Now the other types of lumps in the neck which are non-cancerous are often uh, what we call congenital lumps. So they've been there since you were a baby or developed when you were uh, in the womb and then they can suddenly appear when you're an adult.